people of all sizes, large and little, ladies and gentlemen, and folks somewhere in the middle. Thank you so much for joining me once again in Master Tsushimi's house. I am your loving host, Master Tsushimi. Uh, nobody's joining me today. Mr. President's actually taking his nap. Oh, is that stuff you can do up there? Um, and the uh, wife's at work. So this is just kind of a fun little solo session we're going to be doing here. I literally recorded the last batch of videos last night. That's that's how hype I am about this game. I just I wanted to keep playing it, so I did. Oh, didn't like that though. Still getting used to the counter shield. It's a little bit different. Oh, damn. I missed the hell out of that. That corner, though. Oh, that's right, I forgot I equipped, like, auto finish, which is kind of very helpful in situations like this. I, like, for sure would have just missed the prompt to hit triangle. Some wild water physics are happening. Oh, and the finish is you just do it that all over again. That's that's really neat. That was fun as hell. Oh, okay. Like I usually don't really care much for roller coasters, but that looked fun as hell. Although, to be fair, I always have, like, water rides over roller coasters. I see you, Mushroom. I'm gonna gather you. No worries. Oh, snap. There's some dudes. Dudes would need beating. I'm digging counter shield so far. Yep. God, I forget that's so loud on the. Oh god, it's gonna make me finish even if I don't want to. Oh, never mind. It just faded. I guess because we were out of combat. That's good to know though. Fairly certain I've cleaned out the area. Ah. I say as I find something new almost immediately. Oh, what was that? Oh, some clothes. Neat stuff. Alright. Now I'm pretty sure we've investigated fully. God, the force looks so good, honestly. Not that it looked, like, bad in Kingdom Hearts 2, but damn. Oh, also, they're just treating all areas like one giant thing, as opposed to several different areas. Hold on, I feel like there should be... Ah, oh, damn. Triggered a cutscene. Okay, here we go.
the remembering Namine's whole curtain thing. What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, is it? Because it looks real pretty. This mansion is haunted. Haunted by what? Dead Organization 13 members? Hey there. <laughs> <sighs> Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? Did I scare you? I don't know, man. We were pretty spooked. So how did it Speaking go? of which, I was watching somebody play the uh, Resident Evil 2 remake, and I got like 10 minutes in, and I was like, I don't know, man. I'm a little bit too scared. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. That sounds like the introduction to like a farming slash romancing game, ready? like Stardew Valley. Ah, oh, yes. You've inherited this old mansion. This is your last chance at happiness. Good luck. Yeah. Now can I check out the things that I wanted to check out? Or are you just going to shove me in the mansion? Come on, man. I definitely feel like there had to... Oh, okay. Here we go. So can you not actually explore the mansion? The password was uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, I'm in. How do you Let's get that know all these working? things? Uh, uh. Oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us. We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? Very eloquently put, Pence. None that I know. Great. Well, huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah. But how'd you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Hmm. Uh, I guess those are linked. Oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slime. <laughs> oh, and what? You do? <laughs> I know I haven't got a clue. Then, uh, God, Enzo, get the hair out of your face, dog. Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so I can't uh, run it. Which program? The uh, transporter to the other Twilight Town. Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Oh, was was okay. Zexion just like not virtual town inside at all the computer tuned into data. this? A data scape? Tell us. Mm -hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence. Let's get a network set up. My address here is... They didn't want to get into the uh, technical details, I guess. Which is fair. I'm not sure I would have been interested in them anyway. Okay. Sharing is enabled. <clears throat> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together... I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. 
Meaning, somewhere on your machine, there's a log of that data that, uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Huh. Okay. Go Great. figure. I can't computer, so do that. <laughs> Glad you're Oh, Sora. Along. You absolute caveman. Worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. Yeah, makes sense. He was sense. recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. There's a lot going on, man. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. Later, Sora. Yeah. She said that really yeah. condescendingly. Like, oh, look at him you using his head. Oh my gosh. Oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pets. <laughs> hey. There we go. We're back. Return to town. So what's um, next? Before we do that, though. See, I knew there would be something over here. That's what I was trying to get to. I figured maybe... Oh, you can't actually, like, enter it outside of, like, cutscenes, I guess. Uh, what? Oh. We probably should make our... Uh, yep. Back to town. Ooh, found some barley. You say there should be a lucky emblem nearby? There could be. Oh, come on, really? I'm just exploring. Let me. So Nomura, you please. Think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Handsome. Hmm. Samness. God, how can you tell him apart, really? In the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize it sounds like a miserable saying? existence the other twilight town is just data a heart can live anywhere even inside data there are hearts all around us well now you just sound like a, cons oh, a conspiracy so theorist used to be part of the same person right but look <laughs> now they exist separately just fine oh. if they can also look, true then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you tell him something to see. Yeah. In that case, by all means, nothing would please us more than Roxas's. So is this just like a trick of perspective, of or is Zemnus genuinely you just wish. taller than Ansem? He'll never answer to you again. Still so blind. A nobody is what's left behind when one gives his heart to darkness. 
There is only one way to bring Roxas back, which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> what? Go yeah. on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <gasps> Your heart free. Are they just telling me to die? Like, let myself? It's pretty brutal. Also, it's damn, Neo Shadows, really? Not if it helps him. Anybody got anything to hit me with? Alright, let's just do this this way then. Still got Flare Force in the background. Mad Teacups. I don't think I'm going to make it to do Flare Force, though. Yeah, I missed it by, like, a fraction of a second. Still, like, two of them left. Oh, well, never mind. That's the last of that one. And that one. Cool. Oh, and we picked up Blizzard. I'm always glad when we pick up spells. I may not always use them, but at least we have them. said he said with all my heart okay then all my heart it is I'm getting Roxas out are you with me I Donald, mean if you really Scooby? say so dude huh? Are you you? I don't know what Ansem and Zemnis want but I think we better tell the others to watch out Okay then, let's head back to town. <laughs> okay, now let's actually look for emblems like I wanted. I bet you there's a See, there's like one right there. Here. And actually that reminds me, you can like check your progress on them here. So, there's two missing in Twilight Town. Ugh. That's gonna annoy me until I do find them. But then I didn't really explore the sewers super well, so maybe they're in there. Who knows? Definitely don't see any out here. Plus, there was literally just one on the other side of the wall, so... Seems unlikely that it would be in here. Alright, let's drop a quick save. We haven't done that in a little bit. Nobody likes to lose their save data. Alrighty, let's get moving. It's kind of nice that, like, there aren't, like, walls. Like, yeah, that's where the woods begins, maybe, but, like... I don't know, it just feels very fluid. Nothing's really interrupted. 